And then this is overwhelming. You know, I mean, I didn't expect all this, you know, to have a day dedicated to me. Overjoyed at the honor of having August 6th proclaim Officer Jonathan Weiss Day. You know, I didn't do it for this. I did it for those girls, um, but it's amazing. It was back on June 13th when the San Diego police officer of 22 years heard the call. Regarding a suicidal man who had kidnapped his twin two-year-old girls. Rushing to Sunset Cliffs, where a video captured this. 47-year-old dad Robert Bryan's now charged after driving his truck carrying his two toddler girls off the cliff into the ocean. Officer Weiss jumped into the rescue, which wasn't easy. I've been back there and I'm afraid of heights. <laughs> the former U.S. Marine Corpsman turned canine handler used a 100-foot dog leash to get in the water. So I just took off my, my uniform shirt, my vest, and my gun belt, grabbed the leash, and ran to the edge. Bringing the two little girls and their father to safety. Weiss's quick bravery caught the attention of San Diego City Council member Mark Kersey. I don't think there's any question that but for his heroics, uh, th these three people would have uh, would have wound up dying. So in Kersey's district, in Weiss's hometown, he gets the honor. We just couldn't be prouder of him. He's from Rancho Bernardo, and uh, he's just uh, exactly what we want out of our uh, men and women in blue. And not just for the cliff rescue, Weiss also was the officer who helped apprehend the Poway Synagogue shooter in 2019. It, it's crazy the magnitude that these two events happened almost a year apart, both on a Saturday morning. With a Heroes Award in hand, congratulations. We're declaring it to be Officer Jonathan Weiss Day in the city of San Diego. Protesters might say, or, or, or what's going on, and, and there are some bad things going on. This is still, I think, the greatest job in the world, and, and it's up to us to show people that. Heather Hope, News 8.